Hey guys, it's me, Johnny G. Uh, just a quick note right here. I just received an email saying that being a YouTuber is really hard. And a lot of people have been complaining that they want to quit YouTube and they don't want to do this anymore because they're not getting any views, they're not doing this, or they're not getting that, and, and they're not getting any subscribers, and they just quit making videos. And that, so, uh, that frustrates me a little bit because it's not that YouTubers or other people are going to go to your videos. They're not because they don't know that you exist. What are you doing to get attention? That's the thing. And in order for you to get attention is that you have to go out there and explore. And of course a lot of people like to call it playing the game. Before playing the game, they didn't exist because YouTube has changed so much and now YouTube changed this website all around and now we have to play this game called going out there and commenting on other channels, um, other people's uh, videos. Uh, uh, sending a friend's request or subscribing to them and hoping for them to subscribe to me. But, yeah, that's what you're going to have to do. <laughs> and, and there's no other way around that. Um, you know, unless you promote your video, you pay for your video to be promoted. That's the only way to get attention. Other than that, you do have to go out there and be part of the YouTube community. Go watch some videos, subscribe to some people. Um, you know, don't do that sub for sub stuff. I mean, I believe that's really crap. And we don't want to really do that as well because you're going to be, a lot of people are going to be subscribing to you and yet you're not going to get a lot of views. I've seen there's a lot of people that go out there just sub, 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 sub and they do that sub for sub stuff and they're not getting a bunch of views. You know, they're getting like 25% uh, of views out of the entire 5,000, 6,000 subscribers that they have, which is really, really a bad ratio. And we don't want to really do that. We at least want to have like 75% of your subscribers watching your videos and that's the best thing you got to do. So... Being a YouTuber is really hard. Yes, you know, editing, you know, video, you got to take your time in vlogging, editing, setting up lights, doing whatever you can just to make the video correct. Yeah, I mean, it is it is time consuming and it is work, but as for me, I love it, okay? I'm not doing it to get, a, like, popular on YouTube. I'm not doing it to get money on YouTube. You know, I mean, it would be really good to get some money out of YouTube, but even not, but, you know, it, it's just not going to happen like that. I mean, it, it isn't. Um... You know, because it, it takes time, okay? That doesn't mean I'm going to get um, paid or anything like that or become a popular YouTube within a week or a month. No, it does take time. And it could be probably about two to three years by the time I get some attention, a really good attention from YouTube or be featured on a YouTube channel. Hey, you know, but, yeah, I look forward to it, okay? But I'm going to continue making videos because I'm never going to stop. Even if I, my views go down, I'm, never, I'm not going to stop. I'm going to keep going. And that's what you should do. You should keep going, never stop making videos, and that's the most powerful thing you can do. Even if you have haters, you got people thumbing down your video, you got people commenting bad, on, who cares? Just keep going. Haters got to hate. They're always jealous of you because they don't want you to succeed. And that's going to happen like that everywhere. And that's why you should just keep going and always, always, always put up videos. Always. Okay? And you learn from things, okay? You have to keep looking at your stats. You have to see if your videos are doing well on this one, if it's not doing this one. That's why for me and my channel, I do different things. I do shout outs, I do um, the what the hell's people. You know, I do all this different stuff. And I make sure and I look at it and say, what do people really like? And when I look at my stats, I said, okay, people like this video, I'm gonna continue doing this one. And if people hated this video, I gotta make it better. That's what I do. So. For you, keep going. Never stop. Because if you stop, that's fail. The haters are going to love that. The trolls are going to love that. And, and we don't want you to do that. We want you to succeed. We want you to keep going. It doesn't matter if you have a bad quality camera. And even if you're young and your parents don't know anything about YouTube and they don't support you. But if you keep going and they're going to see the community following you and, and you're going to have a, a, a background of community, a like back of people, they're always supporting you and everything. A bunch of supporters. Your parents are going to see that, and they're going to say, I'm going to buy you a camera, because I want you to keep going, and that's what they're going to do. As long as you make good videos, as long as you keep making it a positive and not putting negative stuff in the videos or anything like that, you're going to keep going, and it's going to be great. And that's why I want you to continue, continue to make some videos. That's what I want you to do. Keep going. And that's why for me, guys... Um, I'm bringing back the shout outs because I want to help you guys out. Because, yes, there's been a huge change here on YouTube besides what I've talked about. There's been a huge change on YouTube lately about the meta tags and related videos. For some reason, the meta tags are not really working anymore, and the description are working more than the meta tags. So I don't even know why they even have meta tags anymore. 
But yes, sometimes the meta tags work, sometimes they don't. Related videos has changed. So basically where your videos used to be, let's say like I do a shout out for a person, I'm not going to show up on their uh, related videos. No way. It has changed. I don't know why it is it's happening, but yeah, it's a new force or a new way of YouTube, the way the website is now set up now. And it's really sad now. And it's really it's going to be really hard to get more attention or to be featured or, you know, at least go a little bit further up than the way it was before. Um, I've noticed now that they've separated the top YouTube YouTubers and they have the middle YouTubers and they got the lower YouTubers. It's kind of looking that that way. I'm not saying that it, it, it is showing like that, but it's kind of looking at that way. I've been uh, talking to a couple of people from the middle, you know, people that are getting views and have some subscribers, but they're still complaining that they're not getting enough attention from YouTube, at least to get featured or at least a little help, a little push for them to be featured on the YouTube homepage. While everybody else, like the Shake Tars, uh, CTFXE, and all of them are getting featured and featured. And I gotta tell you guys that these people that are not featured on YouTube, they got amazing videos. And I think they're way better than CTFXE or the Shake Tars or anything. Their videos are great. And they're not getting enough exposure. They're not getting enough, uh, a lot of attention from YouTube, which honestly for me, <laughs> I feel really bad for them. Because their videos are great, video quality is great, content is great, you know, everybody is good. That's what I like about them, okay? And that's why it's like a game that we got to play again, and, and I don't really like that, you know? I, I just like, just make videos and, and just keep going, you know? That, that's, what, that's what I like to do, and, and that's the way it was before all this stuff happened, you know? Top YouTubers and all that. It wasn't like that in the past. Bass, you make good videos, you just keep making videos, and, and you be part of the YouTube community, and you're, you're, you're up there. You're up there. But now it's totally different now. And uh, one other thing, guys, is um, for the people that some of you that have been complaining about that they don't get enough views, enough subscribers, and these are the, and, the, and I'm not going to say no names, I'm not going to say no names, but this is coming from a YouTube partner who has made 5,000 subscribers within three month range. And gets an average of about 2,000 views a video. Is complaining that he's not getting enough views. And is not complaining. And is complaining about not getting enough subscriber. You made 5,000 subscribers within 3 months. What do you want to complain about? Yeah, your videos are kind of like beginner vlogging quality. But you have a lot of people supporting you right now. So don't complain. And don't complain to your viewers. That's what you're doing. And you're complaining to your viewers. And your viewers are going to give up on you. And they're going to unsubscribe. You shouldn't do that. You shouldn't do that at all. Once again, you're complaining back to the trolls. Your haters. You know, these people that... Uh, thumbs on your video you're complaining to them and they're going to continue doing that because they love it and you are making videos on oh you guys should if you guys want to watch my video unsubscribe or if you guys want to comment don't bad comment whatever don't do that you are a YouTube partner you made partner within three months once again and and one of the things is that you got a shout out from one of the biggest YouTubers out there don't lose that don't lose that. Just keep making videos and just make them better. That's all you got to do. And once again, guys, back to the shoutouts. I'm going to bring back the shoutouts again for you because I want to help the YouTube community that only has a little bit of viewers, a little bit of subscribers. I mean, I have a little bit of subscribers as well. I mean, I got 100 and something. It's good enough for me. I'm going to keep building and I'm going to keep going up. Okay, but I want to help you as well. The small YouTubers, even if you have 500 subscribers, I'm still going to help you. I want to give you some shout outs. At least, you know, show my subscribers what videos you have. And I'm going to be doing that as well. And I'm going to make something huge. I want to do something different in these shout outs. I want to make you not only subscribe, but I want to make these people continue to watch your videos, to favorite your videos. That way you can get some more attention. And we want that. And that's why I want to make these shout outs to be better than it was before. I'm even probably going to open up a new channel. And if I do open up a new channel just for the shout outs, of course I'm going to redo some of the shout outs that I've done in the past to bring it over to the new channel. And of course I'm going to be doing something different like adding you guys into my cool boxes and, and rotating those cool boxes just to when people subscribe to my new channel it's going to be kind of like you're going to be able to subscribe to these other cool people as well support these cool people support these vloggers these skit artists just to help you guys out and that's what i want to do i'm sorry i'm talking with my hands but that's the way i talk like that guys right but that's what i want to do with you guys okay 
Alright guys, so I gotta let you go because I can't make this video too long, but uh, I'm thank you for watching this video, the entire video, and I want to support all you guys, I really do. You YouTubers out there, I've seen you work really hard, and I, and I understand because I work hard too, I work really hard on these videos. Alright guys, alright guys, thank you very much, and you guys have a wonderful day, you guys take care, bye.